This video shows how to update the firmware from the XLights application. This is an alternative method. We also have additional videos on how to update the firmware using SD card. First, you may wish to know the version of your firmware. You can see those versions here. There are actually four of them because there are four CPUs on this particular controller and the major version being this right here. All right. So the first step is, of course, actually to have XLights installed, and we already have that installed. And the next thing we're going to do is go to, in this particular case, joehinkle.com slash firmware. Uh, you may also have an address from holidaycore.com with the same file. You want to go ahead and download this file. It is a zip file, so we'll go ahead and download it, and here it is right here. We can go to the directory and see the file is in zip file format, and within there, there are a bunch of different files, but we do not need to extract those files. The next step is to navigate over to XLights, and we're going to go to Tools, Hinkspix Export. Now this is normally the area where you would go to export to SD card and it also provides this little documented feature where you can click on the controller, right click, and then say upload firmware. You can now select the directory, so we will go ahead and select the downloads directory and select the entire zip file. You'll see firmware package, click open and it will connect to the controller and upload the firmware. So here we are, we're gonna look on here and turn on the screen. And the firmware is being uploaded to the controller and the controller will reboot and start installing the firmware. In this particular case, this controller already has the most recent firmware. And while it has been updated in on the SD card, it is not being installed because it is already the current version of the firmware. Again, if you have questions about how to update the firmware using alternative methods, see our website holidaycore.com forward slash Hinkspix.